Chris, the CEO of Aptera on Tesla Tips and Trips. Uh, what an awesome looking car you've got. Oh, thank you so much. So let's go over the particulars. What, uh, what kind of range are we talking here? Uh, this is a exercise in first principles engineering. So if you're gonna make a vehicle efficient, what do you gotta do? You gotta make it aerodynamic first. Most sedans and SUVs use over 60% of their fuel at highway speeds, just pushing air out of their way. That's garbage. Make them aerodynamic and you'll get better fuel economy. Make it lightweight, you get even better fuel economy. You give it a super efficient powertrain, you get even better economy. So we get 350 miles per gallon equivalent. We burn about 100 watt hours per mile if you're talking an EV today. So we burn about a quarter of the energy per mile of the average EV. The launch edition of this vehicle has a 400 mile range battery pack, but we offer up to a 1,000 mile range battery pack if you want an upgrade. And the solar that sits on top will get you about 40 miles a day of free solar charges. So it acts like a trip charger and it's able to charge the vehicle about 40 miles so a day. So just sitting there? Just sitting there. So wow. in Southern California, you get about 11,000 miles a year of free driving. Right. In drearier places like Seattle or Chicago, you get about <laughs> 8,000 miles a year. Still pretty right. darn good amount of driving, especially if you're paying $6 a gallon for fuel. This is a great trade-up. Yeah. Now, one of the cool things I, I, I find about your company is you were one of the first ones to adapt the NACS plug. We were the Tesla. first one. One. Right, so we, there you go. We started a petition to have our government make the NAC standard, the right, the the North American standard, and then by the graces of Elon, the great Elon Goat, uh, he he What's made the uh, he, he made the connector available and named it the North American Charging Standard, and you know, we just saw it as superior engineering. The supercharger network was so much better than everything else out there. Why is if the if the world is going to dump all this money into charging infrastructure, they should be buying superchargers. Yeah. They should be using the NAC standard. So we saw that very early on, and we said. We want it, we're gonna fight for it, we fought for it, and by the graces of Elon, we got it. So when can uh, someone pick one of these up? Uh, we have 44,000 pre-orders for this wow. vehicle now. Okay. Uh, and we're hoping to have the first validation units done by the end of this year, and it'll take us to kind of mid-20, the next year to start delivering them. So 2024 is the, the year of uh, solar mobility for us. Totally, all right, Chris from Aptera, thanks so much for the time on Tesla Tips and Trips. Thanks, guys.